Hi, I just see here at this uh, gas pump the word liberty, and it reminds me of uh, uh, more than 200 years ago, uh, blood was shed so that an American democracy could be born. Today we've got a lot of problems here in America, and they aren't the problems that are just created by the Republicans and just created by the Democrats. The uh, administrations, uh, uh, back through time, uh, basically, bit by bit, chopped away at the foundations of our freedom, our economic freedom, in many ways turned our country over to uh, the interest of the big banks and the Wall Street. And uh, we see that in this current election. One of the things that I noticed in, uh, in District 1 is George Demos is running for Congress. If you look back at his history, you see at one point he was a lawyer with the Securities and Exchange Commission. He was charged with protecting the interest of, of everyday investors so that they would be protected against the uh, conflicted interest of banks and brokerage companies. A whistleblower came to, the, came to him and said, look, I found out this information about uh, what looks like skullduggery here and, and uh, dishonesty uh, at one of the largest investment banks in the country. And what did George Demos do? Did he protect the confidentiality of that person? No. As a result, that person got fired. Now we can't, now that person, the whistleblower who tried to do the right thing to protect the interest of investors, uh, can't find a job on Wall Street. He's blacklisted. He uh, seemingly violated the very laws that he was supposed to pr protect and defend when he had that position at the Securities and Exchange Commission as a lawyer. I don't want a guy like that in Congress. I don't want a guy like Randy Altshuler in Congress. Get involved. Learn what's happening. Go to the polls and vote on September 14th. Well, I, I don't think somebody who goes and exports and, and transfers and outsources jobs from American companies and sends them overseas should be rewarded by being made a congressman of the United States. I think that uh, my, my daughter is my concern. Her future is my concern. Shh, shh, Emma. And I do not want a person like that in this Congress. And that's why I'm active in this particular campaign. Thanks a lot for all your, your support. I hope you've been able to get a chuckle out of our videos about this very serious subject. America cannot compete unless our education gets stronger and until our, our business leaders stop taking actions that actually support and help the economies of other countries. We have to be competitive. But uh, that's not why uh, Randy Altshuler and his partner started the company. They started it just to make money. That's the only thing that they were concerned about. And that's not the kind of leader I want in Congress. And that's why I'm supporting Chris Cox. <laughs> Oh, it's